Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Fishing with the Robinsons. In this particular episode, we had our favorite niece, Caitlin, visiting from, from the West Coast, and uh, we decided to go out on a half day, did a little bit of snorkeling, a little bit of shelling, and we also did a little fishing. Uh, we started off with some small stuff first to collect some bait, and then we uh, graduated on up to a nice size little lemon shark uh, that we caught on some light tackle. It was a real fun day, real fun half day, and so yeah, let's show you how it happened. Recording, Caitlin. No pressure. None at all. No pressure at all. Look at her. She's got a hawk eye. She's a trained assassin. Oh, what do you got there? That was just on the bottom, I think. That looked like a bite, didn't it? There he is. All right. Oh, he got off. You might have lost your shrimp. Go ahead and reel it on in. Oh yeah, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, get to leave and help. Yeah. it's all right, yep, yeah. we're, we're gonna run aground here soon, so this is gonna be the, right. gotta make this one count, no pressure though, no pressure, it'll go over there, that's fine, it's a big ocean, you're good, don't reel, there you got it, there, there it is, all right, all right, Caitlin, this one is a little bigger. You can let go of the rod. Okay. Do you say you wanted to hold this? Yeah. He's going to prick you good. You got to oh, come in from underneath. Okay, you got to come in from underneath. Good. He's pooping all over the place. Oh, 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 God. What did you eat? Yeah, did you go to the pinfish buffet last night? That's Must have been. One. Yeah, they're pretty. Yeah, he was definitely a golden corral kind of night last night. Nice. You got a big one on the way out. Yeah, this is what we needed. A little bigger one there. Okay, now. What do we got here? A little mangrove snapper. Well, we can't keep him, but we'll throw him, throw him back. But that's that's a, currently our biggest fish of the day. All right, get us another one. Nice catch, Caitlin. Nice catch. So we got my nieces hooked up on a shark. We had a lemon shark swim up behind the boat, and and uh, we've been chumming them up. There's another lemon shark in the water over there. But uh, this, is her, this is her first shark, and uh, we got real light tackle here, so it's going to take a while to get him in. Just pit, pull up, slow. Oh, oh. <laughs> just let him go. I might pull the anchor because we're there's a strong current, and uh, we got real light tackle here, and this is a decent sized shark. So we'll see if he'll. We'll see. We should start to see him soon, maybe. Yeah, I think I'm going to pull the anchor. And we'll just drift back to him because it's pretty light tackle and he's probably out there a ways. Oh, great job, Caitlin. Pull up and reel down. That's as far as you can reel. There you go. So we're getting closer here now. Yeah. Get my hand out. Yeah, there he is. There he is right there. Check it out, Caitlin. Caitlin's about to catch her first shark. Make her dad jealous. <laughs> Way, you watching this? Where are you at, buddy? <laughs> a lot of seaweed on the line. You see him? How about that, huh? That's a decent sized one. There he is. You see him? You see what you caught? That's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy, Caitlin. Pretty crazy. Yeah. But Caitlin's got the, the pump and reel technique down. Pretty darn good. Don't worry about the seaweed. It's going to just fall off. He's coming right at you. Reel, 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 reel. He's coming right at you. Look at that shark, Caitlin, huh? There he is. There. He might get a little feisty here as he starts to see the boat. He'll see the boat. He might like get a little ornery. You're doing good, though. 
Don't worry. Don't worry. You just have to keep pulling and then if he stops struggling, then, then you can go. Once we get him like next to the boat, Caitlin, it's considered a catch because you don't pull a shark in the boat. Oh, you don't? No, you don't know. <laughs> they are angry. They'll bite anything they can get their their mouth on. Come ahead and go ahead and walk back to the back now. Yeah, you kind of just follow the fish around as he as he uh, as he swims around the boat. You're doing great, Caitlin. Wow, your dad's gonna be so jealous. I'm gonna get out some gloves here. Uh, he's gonna run He's again. making a run on you there. All right, I got everything out that we need. He'll tire out, Caitlin. Well, Question is, will you tire out first? <laughs> I'll, I'll turn us around and help us out a little bit. That's a very light rod for that fish, so I'm trying to help you out a little bit. It's pretty neat when you can see the fish on this white. Yeah, we got confused when that was the other fish, and then we were looking at it like that's all. No, no, just follow the line. You know, watch where the where the line goes into the water. And uh, we're like circling each other here, doing a uh, pirouette. We'll catch up to that guy. You had him pretty close to the boat. He'll get tired. If you want to go up to the front again, I'll try to I'll try to keep him in front of the boat. Okay. Okay, make that run. Yeah, sit down if you like. That's fine with me. If this was a tarpon, you'd be in a world of pain because the tarpons, they just don't get tired. <laughs> That's fine, Kate. You don't have to worry about that. The one. sharks get tired after a while. <laughs> keep that line tight. Always keep the line tight. It doesn't even need that rubber thing in there. Don't worry about it. He's in the dark stuff. He's in the dark stuff. He took a little run there. Yeah, look at Kayla, man. He's not messing yeah. around. Well, don't pull too quickly because then the line just comes off the reel if you pull too quickly. You just got to pull slowly and surely. I get him back in the sand. He's really close to the boat now. Keep the line tight, keep the line tight, keep the line tight. Always keep the line tight. Don't let it get loose, okay? There he is. There's Caitlin's shark. Check it out. It's a nice one, Caitlin. Almost said Kyle. Look at the size of him. Yeah. Holy shit. Take your time, take your time. All right, now you Look at go. that, huh? Pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay, it's all right. It's all right, just hold it. He's gonna run back. It like go ahead and go up to the front of the boat and go around. There you go. Had to get it around. He came over to this side. Wow, this is going to be a perfect day. So what will... Don't worry about that. How you doing? Okay. How are your arms holding up? It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's every bit of... 50, 50 pounds, 60 maybe, I don't know. I'm not real familiar with weights on lemon sharks, but he is he's not small. Pretty crazy, huh? You caught that fish, huh? All right, so just so it's, I mean, he is really close to the boat, so, and we don't need to, I'm just gonna, uh, let's see if we can turn him. See if we can get him this way to get him to come by the side of the boat. You want this? The no. no. He's still got a little life left in him. He'll, he's still trying to shake that hook out. He's trying to get away from the 
Are you gonna let him do that? This is where we pour beer on Caitlin's head as she's fighting the fish. She opens her mouth and drinks beers poured right into her mouth. Yeah, you, you could fight a tarpon for hours. All right. All right, let's 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 see here. Back, back up, Caitlin. Walk backwards. Walk backwards. All right. Okay, thank you. All right, let's see how close we can get to the leader here. Wow, he's a good size one, Caitlin. That's a pretty big shark, Caitlin. Look at the size of him. You see him? All right, that's a pretty good... I mean, we got him pretty close here. I'm just gonna... Good. All right, we'll let him go. Good catch, Caitlin. That's awesome. That's a great job. You don't pull those into the boat. Your first lemon shark, well done.